Hey YouTube, this is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists who have low subscribers and low views as well as talented artists from around the world. Now, once again, I have no idea or the reason why they have low subscribers or low views but I'm going to bring it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now today I'm going to do my best to upload about say five reactions and I will let you know on these particular artists as I'm going along. So my fourth reaction of today is coming from uh, Sisters on Wire. I have reacted to them a very uh, long time. Um, when I first started my reaction channel, um, Sisters on Wire was one of my first reactions um, within that month that I had the pleasure of carrying out. And so to go back after, I think, eight months that now that I've been doing my YouTube channel um, is going to be uh, an excitement for myself as well. I want to see the difference. I want to see um, just a lovely comparison because I know they've, they've got it in the bag anyway. Um, this particular track, and I'm reading it, is um, Palski, and I hope I've got that right, or Palski, Palski Mane, um, or is that Palski Main? Let me know about that one. I'm not too sure because it hasn't got the little uh, thing on top of the eye, which makes it a mane, uh, but it just says main. So Pelski main. I hope I've got that right. Anyway, that's going to be my fourth reaction of today. But um, so six sisters on wire and Pelski main. So that's the, that's what it is. But before that, if this is your first time coming over to my channel, then please go over to my homepage and work your way from the bottom all the way up to the top because there's some fantastic, amazing artists which I do not want you to miss out on. And I've broken it down into various categories to simplify it for you. Just remember, when you go into these individual categories, these are artists from around the world, both established artists and non-established artists. And I promise you, you will not be disappointed. Now, before I go on to my fourth reaction of today there's a number of shout outs that i like to give as well as read a couple of your comments so benjo um it's italian man not spanish thank you very much for that and um, monoskin i will be carrying out a reaction um on him um very this week at some point and then i'm going to seriously apologize hands down knees down and apologize to the match to everybody um regarding uh, money skin i really am um karen, karen cleveland good morning how you doing um paul hall shark good morning how are you um bb hates barricade good morning how are you um hs good morning how are you um ikai teplin i hope i said your name right i very much doubt i did um, um laura uh, wooten wooten there you go um leah um, Patterson, how you doing? Thank you very much for your messages. Gert well, uh, Westland, good morning. Thank you very much for your messages as well. I do like everybody. Not everybody does agree with what I say. And I take that on the chin, so that's fine. I just love reading the difference of people who does disagree with what I'm saying. So I'll keep it coming. Um, Peter Stel, um, Stade Miller. I hope I said your name right. Most probably didn't. Um, um, Slev Donben. No, Slev. Do Bolden. Step I most of it. No, I doubt I got your name right. For the first time I recognize the text. Please breathe. <laughs> I will do. Um Alex Ski um Samagon. Um good morning. He goes, look like Elena Lena. Um it's Alona Lona. Um has exhausted herself. <laughs> I get, I get it now. The car exhaust. There you go. I, it took me a long while to realise what you were talking about there. Anyway, look, we're just going straight into my fourth reaction of today. Sisters on the Wire, um, Pelski uh, Man. I, I hope I'm saying it right, but I most probably haven't. I'm, so I apologise for that. Anyway, without further ado, you know what we're here for. Great vocabs and a damn good video, Ojo Music. Can you take it? Kunna, not my own spark, not my own scalp. 
like it, man. So that was Sisters on Wire. If you know, that's a whole family. And this particular track, um, Paleski Manan, uh, Mane. Um, but that's, I, I very much got that wrong. I know I got it wrong. So I'm waiting for that. Even though you heard me say, um, um, I, I, I don't know what this part is. I really don't. And yes, I have to put on the subtitles on my next time of watching this, which will be any second straight after this. And then I'm sure it makes more sense to to myself. This, um, I love the track. The only small little critique that I have on this particular track is towards the end. It was far too long of a instrumental vibe to leave alone without any putting any kind of lyrical contents in there. I was all there, you know, when the, um, the, when the sister came in, when the brothers first started, it was brilliant. You know, he he put he he, he smashed it. Love the texture, I love everything. He brought it onto the table. No, nothing um, wrong in the way how they, he, the intro, the melody is all brilliant. It led me to a place where I wanted to be. But to when the, the third quarter of the song came, and it was just all automatic. It was instrument instrumental all the way through to the end, where there was so much of a big massive gap where you can put at least another verse in there, and certainly another chorus um, flow in there, and just left it to them just dancing about. Um, I don't know. Um, sometimes that doesn't work. Sometimes it doesn't work, and it's it's lucky that the music carried it all the way through because you got a lovely vibe through the music. And the visuals itself dancing about, but you know having a a long outro like that is play, it, it is a very risky thing. Um, not uh, about the same. The plus side of it, if you're this is certainly a disco club song, and a DJ's um, highlight because you obviously you need 
and the DJ needs a gap to do the meet, the re, um, the mixes into it. You know, if uh, and DJs will know what I'm talking about. You need a, a number of space at the end of a track so the DJ can mix that track into another track. So is this a DJ mix? So let me know about that. Is this a DJ mix rather than a um, you know a, a normal mix, which you'll hear on the radio? I feel this is a uh, a visual on the DJ mix. Um, so there's nothing wrong in that. Like I said, it's very catchy. Um, it's very nice. Um, I would definitely dance to this song as you heard me, as you see me doing that. And anyway, um, it's a lovely vibe. It's a lovely vibey track. You can it, it fits anywhere. Um, on in, in the, like I said, in a club, um, in a small little bar, in on the in the car, getting ready. It it, it suits a lot of places. But just that small little thing, it, I think the outro was a bit long uh, for any for any kind of um, mel melody or lyrics not to be on there. But it is a fantastic song. And for that reason, I salute you. You might think that I'm kind of hard, but I, I hope you understand what I'm saying there. Hey.